The classics may have been the first time we saw these iconic monsters, but did New Who do it better? In this video, I look at seven different monsters and see which era did them best. Let the battle commence! To make this battle as fair as possible, we will need some rules. Rule number one. It will be the monster's first appearance in Classic Who versus their first appearance in New Who. Rule number two. There will be no human villains on this list, so don't expect to see the master. Rule number three. Finally, there are way too many Cybermen designs, so I will instead just put both styles of the Mondasian Cybermen against each other. Got it? Then let's get into it. The Autons. We first see the Autons in the third Doctor's first ever story. For New Who, we see the Autons again, also in a Doctor's first story, but this time it's the Ninth Doctor's. Both attack near the end of the story and both cause a huge invasion. The Autons are based on mannequins and although the New Who ones look more realistic, there is something more terrifying about the older style. The Classics take the first point. The Daleks. The Daleks first appear in The Daleks. They are scary and there's a lot of them when the Doctor and Gang meet them on their home planet. For Dalek, there is only one, but that doesn't make them any less scary. At first, the Dalek is all weathered and badly damaged, but it doesn't take long until we see the new Dalek design in all its glory. It's clear that the overall design hasn't changed that much throughout the years. At the end of the day, the Daleks are war machines, and as much as I'm a sucker for the old ones, the ones in Yuffie look more ready for a fight. It's anyone's game as it is now one all. The Sontarans. We go back to the past to meet Lynx, the first Sontaran we ever see. He is all alone and only has one objective, and that is to fix his ship. In New Who, the Doctor goes back to Unit, but it isn't long until we meet the first Sontaran of the story. Soon to be accompanied by a huge army of them, bloodthirsty for war. The prosthetics of the New Who one are far superior, but looks wise, I am not the biggest fan of the blue and feel the black and silver are a lot more intimidating and overall look better. That design has put the classics back in the lead. The Silurians. A Silurian is on the loose and it's up to the Doctor to find it and what it wants. In Wales, people are getting taken underground by the Silurians, who don't seem too thrilled about the humans being on their planet. Now, the design of the Silurians has changed massively. I don't bat the change 100%, but they were meant to be lizard reptiles, so... I have to give it to Mewhoo. The Zygons. The Zygons were first seen in Scotland, who are taking the form of the Doctor's friends at Unit. We see them again back at Unit in the 50th anniversary of the show. Taking the form of Kate Leffin Stewart, the person in charge of Unit, as well as other members. They look very, very similar, so it really does just go to the best production team. I mean, of course it's New Who. The Ice Warriors. In their first appearance, we see most of the Ice Warriors stuck in the ice. And as soon as they are all let out, the Doctor is faced with many Ice Warriors. In Cold War, it's just the one, Grand Marshal Scalda. We see him leave his casing and threaten to blow up the submarine. I will say I do prefer the hands of the older design, but the new who ones just look so cool. That one might have been a little biased. The Mondasian Cybermen. For the first Doctor's last story, he faces a horrifying foe. The Cybermen. They look terrifying, sound terrifying, and nothing is going to get in their way. Throughout World Enough in Time, we see Bill witness the beginning of the Cybermen. At the end, we see a new Mondasian Cyberman. And it's Bill! 
as you can see, the design in Yuhu was very authentic to the first design, apart from the hands. The ones in Yuhu wear gloves, while the older ones show the person's hand. Ugh. The classics managed to take the last point, but it's not enough as Yuhu wins! So that's it. What do you think? Do you agree or disagree? I'd love to see how you scored it down in the comments below. If you're new, don't forget to click that red button down below to join the adventure. We do content from New Who as well as the classics. I've been Lewis and you've been... Brilliant! So crazy passion and we wanted you to know So are you sitting comfortably? Our tribute to the show is If we had to choose another we just wanna know